good morning girls now we are going to start to be syllabus in to be syllabus what you need to remember is we have a total eight units in this book same thing in second year you have two mathematics textbooks one is 2a second one is 2b in first year you used to have 1a and 1b now this 2b is continuation of 1b and it has total eight units unit 1 circles unit 2 system of circles unit 3 parabola unit 4 ellipse fifth one is hyperbola sixth one is method of integration seventh one definite integrals and eight one differential equations now from these eight syllabus we will discuss weightage also afterwards now we are going to start sixth unit methods of integration this method of integration unit is continuation of derivatives what you have learned in derivatives the basic formulas of derivative you need to remember and some formulas of integration also you need to remember daily i will consider some formulas and based on those formulas i will take classes to you what you need to do is you have to form one long we have to you have to take one long notes and write down the formula or everything you have to write and you have to post in whatsapp group this group which is created by uh, one of the student one or two students so what you need to do whatever i am writing on the board whatever you find on the board just you need to copy down in one notes then you have to post by writing your name and roll number post it on whatsapp group these are the things most important thing is to be is totally difficult we can say not that much easy to make it easy you need to remember whatever from starting onwards whatever we deal with formulas or whatever concept everything you have to remember you have to revise by uh, forward or uh, reverse the video then you can revise number of times i'll speak i'll tell you what you have to do those things you have to remember concentrate on whatever i'll say to you whatever i'll write on board everything because we are not in class so i can't see your faces and i can't get to know that who is following and who is not following that is totally not possible now to make it possible what you have to do i can only check the notes and i'll mark attendance by seeing the notes daily by evening you have to post your data so got it now in to be you will be having total eight units and we are going to discuss methods of integration to learn this method of integration i need your total presence of mind so that you can easily concentrate and easily get those things whatever i am going to say to you that you can grab now to learn this unit full concentration and whatever words you are unable to listen in one time you can reverse that and you can listen this one as many as time possible and make it perfect so revise it perfectly i want everyone to revise it perfectly i can call to any one of you from the group and i'll ask formulas by evening so be ready i can call to any two of the students and whatever you will say that uh, skin uh, that screen recording or whatever recording i'll post on uh, whatsapp group or else i'll not put that one just remember to post those things on group then i'll anyhow i'll give in uh, in chat also i'll give you that uh, what to do and what not to do so now we'll start methods of integration to start this unit few formulas are there which you have to by heart perfectly few means some 20 formulas are there same like in derivatives what you have done the same thing you have to do in this also this symbol represents integral symbol this one 
long s is integral symbol how to read this one if i write this symbol integral of if i write k integral of k i will say dx then you have to see the formula for this one now i write the formula integral of k dx equals to kx plus c how to use this one how to by heart you just need to by heart now how to use the formulas in the second uh, in second video you'll get to know now what you have to do whatever i write and how to read also i'll tell you the same thing you have to follow and you have to copy this one in one notes then one by one formula you have to write one one formula 10 10 times minimum you can easily by heart that integral k dx equals to kx plus c what is this kx plus c everything after once you buy the formula i'll show you how to apply this one in real life problems whatever the given problems to you in the textbook second one integral x power n dx x power n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 plus c integral e power x dx you should take e power x plus c then you have integral a power x dx a power x divided by log a plus c then we have integral of 1 by x dx this is log modulus x plus c then you have integral log x dx this is x log x minus x plus c integral of sin hx dx cos hx plus c then you have integral cos hx dx you should tell me sin hx plus c You may face some writing problem, writing issue because uh, you can feel uh, the difference in classroom is different. To learn from uh, those videos is quite different. Integral sin x dx. Integral tan x dx log mod secant x plus c. See, after learning those formulas, after by adding those formulas, I will tell you how to derive them also. First step is to learn integrations, you have to be perfect in formulas. So, first make sure that you are everyone have to be perfect in the formulas. Otherwise, if I take class also, you are not going to understand single thing. To understand 2B from starting day onwards, what you have to do is you have to learn the formulas and I'll at the end of the board I will tell you how to read these formulas also. Then we have integral cosecant x cot x minus cosecant x plus This is sin h inverse x plus c.
two three square formulas are also there you can remember that also Now, these are the formulas. How many? Twenty-four formulas are there. Apart from this, you will be having some four or five extra formulas also. At the when we will go step by step, exercise wise, I will be following. These formulas are enough for first exercise. For second exercise, derivative formulas you need to revise whatever we have been done in first year. That also then along with this. So that means for two exercises. these formulas are helpful and remaining you have to know the derivative formulas along with these formulas so after completion of first exercise we will discuss derivatives also and what is the role of derivatives in integration unit also we, we are going to learn now what you have to learn the formulas first thing is i'll ask you integral k dx what you have to tell me kx plus c what is this kx plus c tomorrow you'll get to know Second one, integral x power n dx. X power n dx equals to x power n plus one by n plus one plus c. Then integral e power x dx. That is e power x plus c. Integral a power x dx. A power x by log a plus c. Integral one by x dx. Log mod less x plus c. Then integral log x dx. X log x minus x plus c. Why I am reading this one? Some word, some of them we can't. Uh, this thing is not visible. So. That's why follow my words, then you can get it. Integral sine h x dx cos h x plus c. Integral cos h x dx sine h x plus c. Integral one by root over x square minus one dx equals to cos h inverse x plus c. Similarly, we have integral sine h dx minus cos x plus c. Integral cos x dx sine x plus c. Integral tan x dx that is log mod secant x plus c. Integral cosecant x dx log mod cosecant x minus cot x plus c. Integral secant x dx is log mod secant x plus tan x plus c. Then integral cot x dx log mod sin x plus c. Secant x integral secant x tan x dx is secant x plus c. Integral cosecant x cot x dx is minus cosecant x plus c. Then we have integral one by root over one minus x square dx. Sin inverse x plus c. See by seeing those formulas, you might remember the integration derivatives. Integration is inverse process of derivatives. Keep in mind. See, if you derivate sine inverse, you will get this. Derivative of sine inverse x. What you have learned in first year? One by root over one minus x square. Now the formula is quite different. Integral and dx is there. In between the formula is there. Integral one by root over one minus x square dx is sine inverse x plus c. Similarly, integral one by root over one plus x square dx is sine h inverse x plus c. Then integral one by one plus x square dx is tan inverse x plus c. Then integral tan square h dx tan x minus x plus c. Integral cosecant square h dx minus cot x plus c. Integral secant square h dx tan x plus c. Then integral cot square h dx is minus cot x minus x plus c. Now what you have to do? First foremost thing, your today's work is by heart all the formulas from one to we have twenty four formulas. These twenty four formulas, each formula you have to write ten ten times. Ten times each, and you have to take snap, write your rule number on each paper, name, and take photograph, pick up that one, then post on your group, so that I can verify that you have done the work, and by heart done. If I find anyone is not done, not doing this work, I may call you and I can ask you the formulas by on call. Okay, so what I want every one of you to do is by heart the formulas. most important thing then if you are good in formulas then definitely this unit be it is very easy tomorrow we are going to complete one exercise from 
this unit methods of integration so totally what are the things you have learned today one total second year max 2b consists of eight units the unit names are there go through with that one we are dealing with sixth unit in sixth unit to start this unit what is integration and all i'll discuss after once you buy out those formulas for now what you need what you need to know is integration is inverse process of derivatives what is this inverse process what are the formulas how to use how to apply everything you are going to get once you have you will you once you perfect in all those formulas so by heart those formulas write it and by heart it okay